Good afternoon, Lauren Groff here with Groff Networks with Technology Tuesday. We're going to talk about Captain Obvious today. What is Captain Obvious? Well, in our world, it means that they tell you the obvious. Sorry, was that too obvious? Um, so a little bit of background. Um, in our world, in our realm, we call you know, this role, it's a dedicated role, somebody that you need to um, you know, plan the strategy, the budget, you know, in large organizations, that call, that's called a chief information officer, CIO. Small, medium businesses, however, can't afford that kind of payroll to have a, someone fully dedicated to that and really stay on it. I mean, it's a strategic role. It's an executive role. Um, so what we've had to do is had to figure out how to partner, provide the opportunity for our clients to still get that budgeting and strategy so that technology can match in lockstep what they want to do and where they're trying to go. Um, you know, they have, for example, they have three year roadmaps mapped out for their clients, laid out for their clients. They have next year's budget already in place. I've talked about uh, in a previous video here. You know, the big server cloud migration that has to happen in 2020, that's on there. It's no big surprise. So Captain Obvious says, you need to replace your Windows 7 and Windows 2008 servers by the end of next year. By the way, if that's not obvious, you need to know that those are going away end of next year. But I digress. Or maybe you have to be, they, they can tell you, oh, you got to be scared about phishing. I'm sorry, if that's not obvious by now, we need to talk. And yes, by the way, and many can relate with this, Captain Obvious might tell you, oh, hey, Mr. Client, you know that server that just went down again? Yeah, well, you got to replace that. Sorry, it's January. Yeah, I know you really wanted to spend that cash last year, but you need to spend it now. Um, that's a virtual Captain Obvious, a VCO, as we call it, virtual Captain Obvious. Uh, so a VCIO has a lot different perspective, like we talked about, you know, it's the strategic. They understand the business workflows, not just the technology and how to keep it in lockstep, but they understand the business workflows. They have the time. And, you know, we can talk about, you know, why and, and why that doesn't, you know, get and happen in place. Um, we're building on that here. But don't let Captain Obvious happen to you is basically the, the message here. If technology is important to you and keeping that, supporting your business in that sort of way, you need a virtual chief information officer. And it's not easy to come by. And just because a managed service company says they're going to deliver it, you need a particular process to be able to, to get there. Otherwise, you get a captain, virtual captain obvious. Lauren Groff, Groff Networks, with today's Tech Tuesday.